Beetlejuice. Well, it's almost Halloween time again, and well, I want to talk about th this movie starting Adam. I mean Adam. I mean Alec Alec Baldwin. Yeah, uh, I almost said Adam Baldwin, which is a Baldwin, but not a, one of the Baldwin brothers. Gina Davis, Winona Ryder, and playing the Tyler role of Beetlejuice, the funny Michael Keaton. And it's involving a couple who is, I think, in Maine, dying in a freak accident. Then, then they were haunting their own house after going to the netherworld. And the person who can, as, as their, kind of like their advisor says, what do you do? Don't listen to my former ass assistant. He's a troublemaker, and then they bumped into him. If you say my name three times, I'll come and help you. And well, they did, and yada yada yada. He started doing shenanigans. Then that, then during this movie, you have the, their house getting sold to a family with some story that's Jeff, who are played by Jeffrey Jones. The funny Catherine O'Hara from SCTV and a very young Winona Ryder as the Dietzes. So and Bill Juice may little Well Well started tormenting them and made a nice friendship with Winona Ryder's character. The special effects in this movie are pretty good for its time and like some franchises, some lives, I mean, some like some movies, Beetlejuice had an animated series that lasted a few seasons afterwards. And if you, it's this movie, it's one of Tim Burton's finest works. Before he went to fucking artsy, prior my French, and hell, and this is one of my few favorite. Favorite Tim Burton films of all time. It's like what it's go. This this combines the cartooniness of eighties comedy with a little bit of horror films. So I'm gonna give Beetlejuice a five out of five.